Hello and welcome to Late Models Fixed at Southern National. I'm here because one of the members of Gavin's community said he was going to run it, Jeremy Freer, and so I said, hey, I'll join too. Uh, talking in his uh, community Second, Discord. Uh, he's uh, got a channel as well, Zanetti10, I believe. Hopefully I didn't misremember that, but I think that's it. <laughs> and, uh, but we'll see how this goes. This combo's been a little tough on me. Kind of struggling where to find speed, but... Hopefully it won't be too bad. It was too high up the track there for sure. I think I'm overdriving, for sure. Yeah, I don't know, man. That was pretty slow. 14920, 14891. Yeah, I'm just uh, struggling to find speed. I think I'm definitely overdriving. But at the same time, you gotta be so aggressive, it feels like, because you, you know, you got the banking that carries you and carries so much more speed than you might expect through here. And it's just a balancing act finding that limit of not overdriving. But also getting the most out of the corner, right? So, one thing I've found is that uh, I'm probably turning the wheel too much on exit a lot of the time, which is natural because it feels like you're going to go up and hit the wall because you're full throttle and you're still only halfway through the corner. But you got to let that banking carry you. Got to trust that banking, and uh, if you get that wheel straightened out a little bit more and fade out toward the exit, it seems like you gain some time. Because you carry more speed, but it's tough. And uh, that's not the best qualifying effort I've had, for sure. Dropping down to 8th now. It's uh, it's going to be scary, I guarantee you. going to be people flying everywhere, I think. So this could be this could end up a little messy, but I did want to give this a try. I've enjoyed Southern National the times I've run it before. Um, it actually provided some good believe it or not, street stock racing on week 13. Um, wasn't uh, too bad at 8.3. I rating. Oh, Lord. Oh. <laughs> it's not going to be good. Oh, boy. Um, well, it seems like everyone's just about ready. We just got the six we're waiting on. That is probably Oops. Yeah, he's probably gonna let me about eight point three times. <laughs> or eight point three K, either way. Or he might lag out, according to that ping. Oh, wouldn't that stink for him? Okay, so we... We are slower than Jeremy here. And just about the rest of the field. <laughs> oh, this is going to be interesting. I'm going to have to be... I'm going to have to be patient. I'm just going to have to be patient. Dodge some things. No cautions in this series. It's, <laughs> this is gonna be bad. Fellas, this is gonna be bad. Friends and family, we are gonna have a rough time. But you know what? I wanted to give this a try. Now's as good as time as any. Um, <laughs> it's just not clicking for me, this combo. Just not clicking. And, uh... The one doesn't lag out. I wasn't necessarily cheering for it. You don't want to see that happen to someone, but that's one person. That's one person we would have beat. One more session. than we're probably Time going to. So, <laughs> this is... Woo! 14.5. Yeah, that's, that's absurd. My best in practice was a 14.7. Just barely. And that would have been okay. We could have like 5th, but... Well... I got 8.1.
breaks all the way back. That's probably not even what you want to do. I'm just gonna hope I don't get run over. Hopefully the guys behind aren't too wild and crazy. I don't know, if they start to be real aggressive, I might just let them go. <laughs> I, I, I don't know. I don't know what I'm going to do this race. I'm probably just going to have to wait and see. And, uh, you know, adjust to the race as it comes. Maybe try to uh, take advantage of some mistakes. I'm on the outside. Like, that's not going to help matters either. I think Justin brought his cut off. I believe we're going to have Jeremy on our inside here in a moment. I'm not going to fight him too hard. Don't want to hold him up. Being part of the same community, it's kind of like we're pseudo team teammates in this one. <laughs> I guess as much as teammates are in real life, because in real life, even if you're part of the same team, you're fighting them hard. You know, you don't let them win, but... Maybe you go a little easier on him. Yeah, I had a guy last night at 10,000. It was unbelievable. 10,000, that sounds like Ty Majeski. Not too many people have 10,000 I rating. That's what they said, right? I missed what they said, but I'm assuming they were talking about the I rating. Well, good luck rating for a second, everybody. Huh? <laughs> yeah, that's what they're talking about. Well, great lap, Justin. Oh boy. Follow car number 10 in the outside column. Rolling. Get the brakes warmed up. I believe that's a thing. In the series. Squeak at him. The brakes feel really weak in this car, by the way. It's kind of been my experience. These brakes. One left to green. Go full pedal to the floor on these things, and uh, it's looking like I want to do second gear start. About to go green. Stay focused. I'm not going to get a good view at all of the leader. Go in 10. Stop blowing your tires, please. Are on the inside? I guess so. Oh, this is going to be interesting. I don't know what happened to the inside lane. Very slow start for the inside lane, I guess. Gonna try to be smooth. Maybe try to uh, be nicer to the tires, maybe, since I don't have very much speed in general. I'm gonna have to watch out for Rex as guys spin it. We got the 7 doing something. It's doing the jitterbug. We got a nice gap behind us. That's very nice, but that's not gonna last. I promise you. Be smooth. I'm not really hitting my line. I don't think I ever was, to be fair. Okay. Past that. Uh oh. Is that the same guy before? D7. Do it. Please hold your bike. Thank you. Trying to get to the bottom, sorry, Joe. No, you're good, I'm almost shit myself. <laughs> Man, if this yeah, if a guy with like whatever they said, like seven thousand, eight thousand I rating loses this race, like if they end up last, they probably lose like three hundred I rating, to be honest. Like you have to imagine. Yeah, I shit myself. I'm a guy. It's 
So I'm doing better than I thought I would. I thought I was going to be like dead last on pace, to be honest with you. Uh, with how bad qualifying went. Uh, but we're kind of keeping up. I don't know what I'm doing to the tires. Probably bad things. Hanging in there. It's a reasonably long race. We have 50 laps here coming up. So... Got some time, maybe for the uh, tires to matter a little bit. There's a car exiting the pits. Heads up. Car exiting the pits. Oh, I hope he doesn't do it in front of me. We're good. Even even if he was like perfectly good as a lap car, I mean, still that's gonna slow you down a little bit. So I wanted to watch out for that. Looking like maybe if I stay on the brakes a little longer through the corner, I might give me a little bit of speed. Part of the whole not overdriving thing that I'm supposed to be doing. Hmm. I just don't feel like I'm gaining anything. This is pretty much equal on speed. That lap time was 15.1. Huh. We need some guys to do side by side racing so we can start catching up to people, I think. And it looks like they kind of were for a moment there. I saw that 7 fight someone. I guess we better watch out for that one to come lap us, because I have a feeling he's going to by the time this one's over. When you are that fast, kind of expect it. But I really don't know where he is right now. He might not be as far as I think. But it is a short track, so that's why I'm kind of expecting it. I got some side-by-side -side going on up there now. Oh, and sideway side <laughs> for the 10 for a moment there. On the brakes too hard, I guess. Your last lap time was at 15.2. All right, they're fighting a little bit. They even side-by-side, -side, they're not really even losing all that much time. Drop that one. kind of found something here for a moment. And hitting the wall. That last lap was at I'm going to let it roll on the bottom now. Oh boy, they're starting to jostle a lot up there. Fighting each other and hitting the wall and losing their marks, I guess. We start to see some dive bombs because that sure looked like a dive bomb. Like the 10 was ready to take out the 12. You've just done oh, for driving. Okay, we're halfway to the finish. Halfway! Alright, that's actually, that came a lot quicker than I expected right, it to. You're halfway home. Your fuel is fine. Ooh, I hooked the bottom pretty good there. Wish I could do that consistently. Almost got a little bit too eager with the throttle there and hit the wall. That lap was at they bet the fast guys they can do that thing where they hook the bottom like I did the one time pretty consistently. Right where their speed comes from. Ooh, almost in the wall again. But it was fast. Whatever I did there. This is pretty fun, though. So 
We're up on the 10. But. Well, now we're going to pass. I don't want to rear end them. The lap time was at 15.3. Hmm. But it's going to be hard to get the nose on him if he's. Gonna be on the bottom the whole time. But she has every right to be holding his line down there. Sorry, Ed, I'm not racing for position. Ooh, good exit. Not enough, though. Not enough of a good exit. Just need him to come up the bottom like that a few more times, and at the right time, so that I can take advantage. A little swervy, that's for sure. You've just done a 15.3. Ugh, just not enough. Not enough. I'm trying. I'm really trying. He looks like he's trying even harder, though. He looks like he's struggling to keep that pace. Almost looks like his right rear is making him loose or something. an ounce of wall there for a moment. Your last lap time was at 15.3. Oh, I almost hooked the bottom at just the right time. I was not there though. Oh, it's fun trying though. It's fun. I keep saying though. I'm sorry. And then, ooh, I was on the gas too early there. I had to lift off. Oh my god. He was on the gas too early and he didn't lift off. That might have been hard enough to give him damage unless uh, prediction code just made that look worse than it was. Scare him maybe? Nah. <laughs> just cannot get enough speed out of this car to make a pass. Ooh, basically drifted through the corner there and it was pretty far, pretty fast. Almost feels like my right rear is uh, getting hot. That might benefit me more than it hurts me. I'm trying, man. This is why I uh, bought this car. Participate in this series and try to improve my short track racing. Getting past people like this. Because I gotta learn. I gotta get better at this. Figure out ways to get by people. Oh, he's has a bad corner. Still not enough to take advantage though. Oh, it's falling apart. Come on, we gotta take advantage. He is getting sideways. Five left to go. Push down. Catch up here. Only five left to go, man. That flew by. I cannot. I cannot get enough of a run on him on exit. Almost, almost, almost. Two to go. Two more. Let's go. Go. White flag, White flag, flag this time. 
<laughs> I cannot, I cannot figure out how to get by him, man. White flag, last lap. That lap was at 15.4. Uh, oh, car. Well, couldn't figure out how to get past him, but it was a good race. P7. That's the end of the race. We'll get him next Whew. time. Check it flag, check it flag. Good job. Very good job. Huh. I'll find a nice safe place to stop. Alright, so it wasn't a huge mess or anything. I was worried we'd be wreck dodging. But, uh, well, we moved forward. I don't think we actually, like, passed anyone normally in that old race, but, um, say good racing. And the four not had to pass me when he was there. Oh, really? Four was being annoying. That's uh Uh, I guess everyone's giving their tires. 85, 87 is what I have. 85, 87. Enough so we can compare that with everyone. So we have 85, 88, 87, 85. Holy cow, that's good. That's what I should be trying to do. So, uh, yeah, been lucky. Uh, 84, 87, 85, 87 is what I had. So I guess I could have even been a little harder on the gas. Wow. That was tough. That was tough racing. Uh, we end up exactly in the middle. 7 of 14. Um, I'm glad I moved forward a little bit after a rough uh, qualifying. Definitely don't know how to get uh, short run speed. What was that start? I want to see that start because that was... I feel like we gained like three spots on the start. Look at that inside lane. Super not compacted. Huh. Build your start. Me. So far back. Look at that. Wow. I didn't. I knew something happened. I didn't realize it was that far back. Like, look at that. That's like a hole. That's like all of turn and turn four, right there. Hmm. Ten was pretty far back too for me. Like they just were like not up on the bumpers at all. Even I could have been a little closer. Seems weird. Maybe that's just how they wanted to do it. But the fact that I was able to get to the bottom immediately really helped us out. I thought for sure he was going to be down there, so I kind of gave the lane, and I'm like, wow, they're not even close, are they? Huh. Interesting. So let's see the incidents properly. Uh, speaking of the 13, go up and get the wall, it looks like. We're in five. They almost look like they're teammates, but uh, <laughs> it's like the five kind of cut down a little bit on him. It caused the four to spin. Oh, 
no. And the 11. They just drive right into him. They just didn't, he they didn't see it coming, I guess. Didn't know it was happening. That probably killed both their motors. That was head-on hit. Racing up front. Some wall hits. It's going to be a wall hit. That was a pretty solid one. Yeah, I was not happy. I wouldn't be either. <laughs> that was a very far back start. Basically, it was half a lap down before things started. 11 still out there, huh? Oh, there's a fast repair in the series, isn't there? There is. Oh, that's right, because that 4 is the one that was kind of in the way for Jeremy. Apparently. Didn't see it myself, but uh, sounds like it held him back from catching me, which I'm sure he would have. Because I was uh, struggling to get by the, f in f by the guy in front of me, too. Kind of getting held up, so... Is he just wall hits? Here's a 10 hit in the wall. I'm looking like I'm overdriving exit. That could have just been that one time, too, though. <laughs> Maybe that's what I need to think of. Think about next time I'm coming through here. Yeah. Huh. Here's the 4. Oh! Getting hit by the 11. Oh, it's... After the race was over. Huh. Interesting. Teen is upset, maybe? Just playing around? I don't know. I don't know what that is. Alright, so. Uh, not my finest performance. It wasn't too bad. Uh, better than kind of I expected, because I was expecting to be pretty slow here. Just based on my practice times and <laughs> qualifying effort. Uh, so I, it, I didn't have it quite figured out. But we were able to get a very fortunate start. Which basically had us qualifying a couple spots ahead. Basically 7th. And then staying 7th for the race pretty much. Other than the guy that wrecked and all that. So uh, We got some fortune. We got some luck. Like I said, fortunate. Had some luck. And uh, got ourselves a zero X too, which is nice. Um, it was pretty clean overall, though. We had just the four and the eleven. Those two guys that went uh, head on into each other. Those are the two guys that had the biggest problems. And then we just had a couple of four uh, Xs, a two X, and then the rest was good. So not bad at all. Um, gonna lose I rating from this almost definitely, but probably not too much, and that doesn't really matter. I'm in this series to learn anyway, so. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Uh, should have been pretty uh, interesting to watch, I think. Hopefully. Trying to get by the guy in front. I don't know what you guys are into, whatever. <laughs> it was fun for me. But uh, I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching.